Hi, your name is? My name is Ginger, and I'm from Tucson, Arizona. And uh, you've been at the uh, Environmental uh, Health I've Symposium? Been at, I've been at EHS for the last three days, and <laughs> uh, it was my first physical encounter with the Relax Sauna, although I've been hearing about it for about four years and how fantastic it is. And I was hesitant to buy another sauna because I already have um, a wooden FIR sauna, and I couldn't really justify having another sauna, but I thought, well, I'm here and I, I better try it and um, I was pretty astonished by the immediate results within five minutes I could feel a major difference with as compared to other FIR saunas that I've tried. Um, the first thing I noticed is that it was very easy for me to tolerate it. The EMF is reportedly low and I knew that but I really tolerated it very seamlessly. Because you're sensitive to EMF? Very sensitive to EMF. It was much easier to be in the sauna than it was to be in the lecture hall. Oh, good, good. <laughs> in fact, being in the sauna helped me tolerate the lecture hall. So that was wonderful. I would do a five minute, six minute sauna in, in between sessions. And I just found it um, really relaxing and rejuvenating. And it felt powerful but gentle and thorough in a way that the wooden sauna with the panels that wouldn't necessarily hit your whole body areas. Um, it just felt like you were being surrounded in this like gentle mist or this gentle bath of healing frequency, healing energy, and it was just seeping into you. So that was, that was my experience, but I was pretty thrilled with the tolerance and the after effects, I'm very sensitive, so I could actually feel the after effects would last for some period of time. Um, of the other far infrared saunas? No, no, oh, oh. Uh, of this one, I could, feel the the, good. The, I could feel the benefit lasting. Oh, right. Like I feel right now the benefit from the 10 minute session I did earlier this afternoon. I mean, yeah. Who feels that? I do. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. um, I'm looking forward to the next one, but I'm going to pace myself. Um, so I ended up um, buying one for myself and uh, am helping you, my friends, at least three or four friends, buy their own. Right, and then you got one for your your uncle. That's actually my father. The father. Okay, good. Yeah. So. Great. Um, so I'm I'm really happy with it, and I've just been hearing testimonials from people that I trust over quite a period of time. Uh, so I had some trust going in that I wasn't just being sold the next thing because there's always the next thing. Um, so I feel good about the product, and I'm looking forward to the healing benefits. So, so you've, you, you've been in a different far infrared sauna. That's what FIR means, far infrared yes. sauna. You've been in a few others. Yes. And they don't feel as warm and loving, or how do you um, describe the difference? They don't feel as tolerable to me. Okay. Um, I've had you know EMF reactions. I've had agitation. I'm feeling anxiety after, and I'd always thought, oh, it's because I'm detoxing or I've mobilized heavy metals or something. And this was a very different experience that I didn't I didn't feel. Oh, we're talking about the relaxed sauna because usually people are sitting in the relaxed far infrared sauna. That's relaxed saunas mm -hmm. with an S dot com. The relaxed sauna. Yeah. Right, relax. I didn't have the feeling of agitation or exacerbation, but with the um, other FIR saunas, they were harder for me to tolerate, and I would feel discomfort. That's and great. I don't think I could tolerate the amount of time that I did today in the relaxed sauna. It feels compatible. There's nice. just a feeling of compatibility with my body. Good. And it's helping to. I've done a lot of detoxification over a long period of time, but it feels like it's getting things out of pockets that maybe have been sequestered or that my other methods weren't addressing fully. So I'm really looking forward to this. And uh, people, you said EMF, that's electromagnetic frequencies. Yes. That you're sensitive to. Yes. Very yes. sensitive to. Very sensitive. And you did not have a problem with the no, relax on. not at all. And there was, the conference was very high enough. I was sitting right. around hundreds of people with their laptops, pulling in Wi-Fi, and everybody had a laptop and a phone and a tablet. and. You know, the whole room was buzzing, yeah. and I was able to do this. This sauna was an antidote for that. So that was, <laughs> I mean, that's like more than you can ask for, right? Yeah, that's great. It was great. the opposite of EMF sensitivity. It was EMF recovery. Beautiful. So that, yeah. that's, that's, that's why I got it. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ginger, th this was, uh, I really appreciate it. I think the many people in the world will really appreciate what you said because they question. 
you know, whether the relaxed sauna is is safe or whether it's whether it causes problems with people who are sensitive to electromagnetic frequencies. And you are probably one of the great canaries of the world, and, and you tested out the relaxed sauna and got a hands up or a thumbs up. Right, a thumbs up. <laughs> Two <laughs> thumbs up, yeah. And, and that's the Relax Sauna, Relax Saunas with an S dot com. Ginger, thank you so much, and keep in touch and let me know how you're doing. Thanks so much. Bro. Okay, bye.